we? Oh my god. I'm excessive rising with your murder, Jack! It's not murder. Well, it looks like it now! See? What are you doing? I have to answer it. Just ignore it. I can hear you. Open up, please. Yes? Everything okay? Fine. Fine. Beautiful day. It is. Can I help you with something, officer? Officer? Yeah, I'm here to deliver a package. Andrew Klingelman isn't home? Oh, my neighbor. Of course. Yeah. <laughs> Klingelman, funny name. Sure, yes. Hey! What? You gotta sign first. Oh, okay. Here you go. Have a nice day. Oh, fucking millennium. Oh, just a package. All good. All good. Cameron? There's an island off the coast of Mexico called La Isla Mujeres. It always reminded me of La Isla Bonita, the Madonna song. You been to Mexico? No. My dream has always been to sit on the white sandy beaches and watch the sun set over the turquoise Caribbean ocean with my Mexican lover. Sun doesn't set over the Caribbean? Gulf, maybe? And watch the sun set over an ocean with my Mexican lover. But now, I will never have that chance to. Instead, I will watch all the sunsets from inside my federal prison with my face tattooed boyfriend who's doing 15 to 20 for washing money in a laundry. <laughs> when you're finished, I have an idea. We call the police? No. Fuck. So, Andrea Klingeman has to come pick up her package, right? Right. So, when Andrea Klingeman comes to get her package, she'll see... A hellscape of terrible decisions. Nothing. Because we'll take Aiden's body and we'll hide it in the bedroom. Then, when Andrew Klingman comes in the hallway, there's no dead body lying there. You killed him in the bedroom. Ah, huh? not so fast. We'll hide him in the closet. It will be the nicest thing in there. Then, we'll have Andrea walk with me to the bedroom. Because that's where I left the package. So, she'll walk through the entire apartment and become witness to the fact that there was no dead body anywhere in here. Do you ever think to apply yourself this hard at work? We still have a body to deal with no matter what Andrea did or did not see. Uh, not so fast. After Andrea leaves, we'll wait an appropriate amount of time after which Aiden could have come over for a normal hookup. It had a name? It was Aiden? Then we'll take him out on the landing and we'll roll him down the stairs so it looks like he tripped on his own and fell. And after being here for just a short time. Fine. What? I have two options right now. I can leave this house of madness called the police myself, and when you're released from prison years later, drink brandy by the fire, wondering if this is the night you've come for your revenge, handing me a rose, whispering, I've already poisoned you. Or I can help you out. And when we go to prison and become lovers slash leaders or rival homosexual gangs, I can write a tell-all book about it that will be turned to a hit HBO show. I choose the latter. I choose me. Great. <laughs>